One of the drugs used is Lupron, right? Which mm -hmm. has actually been used to chemically castrate sex offenders? You know what? I'm not sure that we should continue with this interview because it seems like it's well, going in a particular direction. Well, you're a medical professional. I am a medical professional. So you don't want to talk about the drugs that you give to kids or? Again, I'm a physician and I use medication. You're choosing exploitive words, drugs I give to I'm, kids. I'm choosing a chemical word concentration. that was in a dictionary. That's not a correct term for puberty blocking. I, mean, I could like, look it up person. on my phone, but I'm pretty sure if I looked it up. Like, you, you can look it up on your phone. The administration of a drug to bring about a marked reduction in the body's production of androgens and especially testosterone. And I'm saying, as a pediatrician who takes care of hundreds of these kids, when you use that terminology, you were being malignant and harmful. I mean, there are some who would say that giving chemical castration drugs to kids is malignant and harmful. 